Hello and welcome to another Lego challenge with me, Adam from Cow's Library. As always, watch the video, have a go at the challenge, and then with permission send us any photos or videos you've made of the things from the challenge. So, what is this week's challenge? Well, it's lock, lockdown 2.0. It is the second week of this second lockdown for us here on the Isle of Wight. So, what are we doing? Well, I thought we could be a bit historical. So, I want you to build either uh, uh, a scene about a person, a scene about a, an important part of history, or an invention from throughout history that you know about that you think would be good in Lego. So, I'm going to show you one first. This one is about two particular people that I think are very important. So, it's not quite accurate in how it looks, but it, it is about who I think is important. So, over here you've got Grace Hopper. She was a lady who worked on, I think it was called the Harvard Mark I computer, which was these big computers back in the day that took up whole rooms. Um, and then gradually computers have got smaller, but she was involved in the programming, coming up with and designing the computer languages, some of which we still use now. So that, that's my little design of Grace Hopper. And next to her, I've done like a little scene of M Marie Curie working on her radioactivity research. She was the first woman to get a Nobel Prize, and I think she was the only woman to get a Nobel Prize twice, which is pretty impressive. So these are two people that I think are important, especially at the moment, um, learning about radioactivity and stuff like, you know, it's, it's become very useful over the years. And then so is computer programming. So that, that is a scene about two people from history that I think are important. The next one is uh, an invention or a device from history that I think is important. So when the, uh, the Nordic people travelled the seas, and, and wanted to get from one place to another, they had to build boats, and their boats were kind of very simple, but also very, very powerful, beautiful ships, you know, with their dragon heads or creature heads at the front going all the way thin and back, and they had lots of people rowing, but they also had sails, they had different styles of ships, but they all had things in common, like, like the arched curve on the back, so this is my little little design of 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 that, as you can see. That there we go. And then the final thing I made, which I'm going to show you, I'll pick it up and show you. So this one is a scene from history. So I am very into the history of Japanese, Chinese, and Mongol um, cultures from centuries ago, when there were things like uh, what was called the Hundred Year War. Um, there was a few of those. Um, very, very strange time in history. And so here is a scene I've done from one of those battles, my idea. So it's based on um, a situation that happened between the Japanese and the Mongol um, uh, society in uh, an area called Toshima, which is an island. So it's an island in between China, Mongolia, Korea and Japan and it's just this like long thin island and um, unfortunately people had to fight there for a long time over this island so uh, yeah this is this is what I uh, decided would be a, a scene that I, I thought would be interesting to make so I'll just show you some different angles So they were my three ideas, uh, one that was a, a scene about some people from history, one that was a scene of uh, a situation in history, and one that was uh, an, in, an invention or uh, a device that some people or someone had to use during history to do something amazing. So have a think about the things you've, you've learned about or the things you know about. Maybe it could be something to do with someone in your family you knew about. Maybe one of your, one of your relatives many, many years ago was a, an, an explorer or something like that and you've been told lots of stories about what they did. Maybe that could be what you make. You make a scene going up the side of a mountain, someone climbing up. 
it's up to you. So have a think, come up with some ideas, and as always, be creative, have fun, and stay safe. Bye!